It's been more than a year since our last MSI gaming laptop review. I'm very excited to say I've actually been really waiting for our next one. And this is exactly what we have today, guys. So I did call the GS65 a beast gaming laptop, but today we are looking at a beast on another level. This is the MSI Creator 17 and it's the best laptop that I have ever had my hands on. So let's begin the review and I'll let you know about everything, including my experiences with this amazing gaming laptop. How are you doing, my friends? I am Rotodil and all I do here on YouTube is basically review gadgets. So if you are for the first time here on this channel, maybe click on the red subscribe button down below so you can see me on my future videos. And I actually plan on doing some more videos about the MSI lineup when it comes to gaming. This is a huge part of my channel. So definitely click on the red subscribe button so I'll see you on my next videos. So as you can see here, I got the box on the table, but I didn't box all of this stuff three weeks ago when I got it. But I just wanted to show you guys what you get when you order this. And I actually got this bag for the second time because I did get it with the GS65, which is my MSI, my uh, former MSI laptop. It's still here. It's still <laughs> behind the camera and it's an amazing laptop but you get this bag and it's an amazing bag. It has a lot of room for a 17 inch laptop, which we will talk about in a moment. And you also get obviously the AC plug uh, inside this box. But the big thing here is, is this. This is the MSI Creator 17. And uh, this time the box is white. We did see on the GS65 a black box. So I actually like the black and white difference that we have between these two uh, different models. And let's just get the laptop out because that's the biggest thing, guys. And I have it over here, as you can see. Um, it's in uh, silver color, actually. And ex excuse me for my English because this is not my uh, primary language. I'm doing this <laughs> as I believe that many people around the world will want to hear about this laptop. And besides the actual laptop itself, which we will talk about in a moment, you do get the manuals and that's about it. The box is empty. So uh, no stickers over here for uh, you guys who are waiting for stickers, but we did get a lot of uh, other cool stuff when I did meet with MSI on uh, different conventions. I got a huge pile of lucky models, which is the MSI Dragon that I really like. But let's talk about the computer right now. So the MSI Creator 17 is my main laptop right now. It's basically replacing the GS65. I'm saying that because I get a lot of questions about what laptop or computer that I use to edit my videos. This laptop has so many innovative features and after using it for a couple of weeks, the 17 inch monitor is amazing. With a 4K resolution and HDR1000, I didn't even want to connect an external monitor. It's the first laptop with mini LED display in the world, and we will talk about it in a moment. The MSI Creator 17 has the latest 10th generation Intel Core i7 processor. We are talking about the Comet Lake Age, and GeForce RTX Super Series graphics cards. I personally have the GeForce 2080 version with Comet Lake i7 10875's age CPU. I also have it with 32 gigabytes of DDR4 memory and two terabytes of NVMe SSD. So I can talk about the MSI Creator 17 for hours, but I wanna point out the three biggest things that I had with my experiences with it during the last three weeks. And the first one is that this laptop is made for creators in mind. The 17 inch 4K resolution mini LED monitor is amazing. For any creator who is editing videos or working on graphic creation, it's super bright and the colors are amazingly accurate. With the high resolution, you don't really need an external monitor for complex editing projects that usually requires a huge interface. And you also get all the features that creators need, including the Thunderbolt port. This will get you high speed file transfers and beyond that, you have the micro SD slot and a great battery life, which MSI basically tells us that's gonna provide up to seven hours. I actually got around five or six, which is good enough for my editing projects as usually I forget my AC adapter at home when I leave it. So like the GS65, I'm very happy with the battery life I got on this laptop. One thing I want to point out is this laptop also support USB-C charging via Pyro delivery that for people like me, if we forget the uh, AC uh, adapter, we can actually use uh, power delivery and charge up the laptop via USB-C. And I think it's kind of amazing. And I really wanted that on my GS65 and I'm very happy that I have it over here. So when speaking about this laptop, the second highlight I want to point out is that this is a 
powerhouse of a laptop for gamers. And MSI really knows how to create gaming laptops and PCs, and the Creator 17 is not an exception. I find myself usually gaming around two hours every day, and now using the Creator 17, it's laptop gaming on a level that I've never experienced before. If you really wanna see me play live, by the way, you can check out my Gamer League channel on YouTube. Just make sure that I don't speak English over there, so I hope you can still enjoy my live shows. So how good is the MSI Creator 17 in gaming? Well, I got over 7,000 score on 3D Mark, which is almost double than what I got with the 1070 um, NVIDIA graphics cards back on the GS65. So I'm very excited, it's almost double the rating. And I got more than 45 FPS and sometimes 60 FPS in 4K gaming in almost every game that I tried using this laptop. Comparing this to my GS65, I will never came over there back again after using the Creator 17. Also, since this has an RTX graphics card, you also get the ray tracing features which is available on the new graphics card. And in the end, since I have the 2080 version, I have a lot of power to run all of the future games I'm waiting for. Cyberpunk, come out already. So reason number three why I think this laptop is amazing beyond the actual specs and power is that MSI really makes sure that you also get neat software when buying their laptop or gaming laptops. And in the end, I saw with the GS65, we got the Dragon Center, but now we have the Creator Center and the Creator Center is amazing for creators. The reason is you can actually tweak many of the laptop settings. This includes many options that affect the resource management on the laptop and optimization settings. One of the options that I really like is that you can actually silence the laptop fans and you get a creator mode which optimizes the laptop to actually provide more resource allocation to specific applications. For example, the Adobe Suite or other applications that creator usually use to create content. So for me, I'm using the Adobe Suite to edit videos like this one and having a feature like that can, that can basically provide me with more power when editing videos, that's like, that's a no-brainer for me. When I look at this model, I say, hey, that's exactly for people who want a game and still work on creating content and that's why the creator lineup for me is a dream come true. So we talked about the three highlights for me when basically using this laptop for a couple of weeks, but I wanna answer a big question here. Is this the ultimate laptop? And I gotta say that for me it is, but we all have our own needs. Getting the MSI creator with my specs will definitely not come cheap, but if this is a worthy investment for you as this for me, you will find that this is the ultimate laptop. But also know that with great power comes great fan noise. And now with MSI, it's a lot quieter than the other gaming laptops that I've tried. And also MSI has great software that we talked about that can tweak out the fan noise and even silence them all together. But in the end, if you're coming from a gaming PC that is standalone and tucked away somewhere, and then you uh, switch to this, you will hear the fans, especially when gaming without a headset. Once using the uh, laptop itself, you hear the fan and you actually feel the heat on the left part of the laptop, the WASD keys basically. This is something that I didn't feel like is hot in a way that could actually uh, kind of stop me from playing, but you gotta know that when gaming on laptops, these are the kind of things that you see. I feel like with MSI, we get a lot of options to reduce that, but in the end, when switching from a standalone PC to a gaming laptop, you need to understand that this is, this is something that you get along with the laptop itself. So that's it guys. I kind of feel like this is like, I don't have enough words to actually describe to you what this laptop means to me, but it kind of feels, feels like MSI basically thought about people that like gaming obviously, and also like creating content. So for me, this was a no brainer in choosing my next uh, laptop. And I think for many of you guys, this is something you really wanna check out. So like always, I'm putting links in the description of this video below for more information about this laptop model. And I'm kind of excited to say that we also will look in the future into a uh, new MSI models and other MSI models. Let me know in the comments below what laptop you are currently using and I hope I'll see you on my next video. I have two recommendations for you to watch over here. So definitely check this one out if you enjoyed this video and also subscribe by clicking on this button. And here's another recommendation over here. Thank you very much for watching. I was Rotodil, I'll see you on my next video. Bye bye.